remember Mike said to me when we met, he was just like, um, you've got a great voice, but um, I'd prefer people to appreciate you for your voice than with your age. You know, 13 going, you sound so old for a 13 year old. And now it's more the emphasis is on my, is on my singing, which is quite nice. So. And it was just a case of kind of like growing up, staying at school. I really enjoyed school, so that was a problem for me staying there. Um, and I wanted to be educated and um, have a laugh with my friends, you know, properly kind of learn. And um, 18 just seemed like an appropriate time for me to start working properly. You shouldn't have What was great is that Mike and I, when I was 18, we found um, the track of Fall in Love, which is originally by Tina Turner, which is written by Ike. And uh, we, we recorded that track when I was 18, and I remember just absolutely falling in love with it. And I've always been really into soul and Motown. And when Mike and I heard that, we were just like, yeah, this is what we want the album to be like. I'd love to do, maybe in the future, like um, some vocals over like drum and bass. Got quite into drum and bass at one point. I'd like that really kind of soul, over, like something like Mr. Scruff, like a bit funk. I like things like that. Um, but it's always been soul for me. I, I just love it, you know. Uh, classical music, folk music, not really my thing. I can appreciate that it's like beautiful, it's just not really jazz soul bordering on a bit commercial, a bit of pop, you know. Um, that's, that's what I love, really. I love performing more than anything else in the world, which is a nice discovery. Um, yeah, I mean, it's definitely a learning process because you're on the road um, with a band and, and tour manager and, and you become quite a close-knit kind of family. And, um, yeah, it's kind of looking after yourself as well. I've realised how nice a good crowd is, actually. It's so key. If you come on stage and you can do the best gig in the world, but if the audience aren't feeling it, you're going, you know. But if you come on and you do it and the audience are feeling it, like it's the, it's the best feeling in the world. You come off that stage and there's no high like it. You shouldn't have